the Sarge and OQ Review, right here on Sirius XM's Hip Hop Nation. Yeah, man, it's the Sarge and OQ Review right here on Sirius XM's Hip Hop Nation. Straight hip hop hits, period. Sarge, all of a sudden, it smells good up in here. It smells good. <laughs> Hold on, check this out, Lando. It smells good in here. But here's the thing, though. I went to give somebody a hug, mm-hmm. and look what got on my phone, some mascara. Mm, to mascara. Let me get that shit off that phone. <laughs> right now, bro. You yeah. mess up my happy home, goddammit. Ladies and gentlemen, straight out of Philly. Yes. We got the lovely Tamel hanging out with us Tamel, tonight. what's up? What up, what up, what up? Sorry, can you adjust that, bring mic? that mic? Bring that mic, bring that mic. Oh, let out. me come a little closer. What up, what up, what up? Yeah. So, Tamel, you know, um, you're a... Uh, uh, um, you, you know, you're an uh, R&B sensation out of Philadelphia. Mm-hmm. Who's uh, come highly recommended come by highly different recommended. of Let me tell you something. Anytime Shaheem Reed, <laughs> legendary Shaheem Reed, <laughs> journalist, <laughs> extra, turn, turn, turn Shaheem Mike up. Man, you know. His mic is up. He just cool like that. I'm all the way up. There we go. All the way up. Shaheem, please. Don't start that shit. <laughs> because, no, you, you hear the music, man? Here's the thing. Listen. <laughs> Okay. The Bronx been kind of cold for the last tw- 20 years, and now Orlando uh, finally got a reason to just scream Webster Houses projects and shit like that. So, by the houses stand Butler up. Houses yeah. Cross. Yeah. What's, what's, what's that? What's that? What's that? Cross thing? Bronx Expressway. Get it right. Yeah, but go no, ahead. no, no. What's that? about street, that. Though? It's, it's not about that. It's about some else. It's, 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 yeah, yeah. All that. Yeah. Hip hop was born there. But go ahead. Uh, what happened? <laughs> so, 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 you know. First, I'm gonna go Shaheem. Shaheem. Yeah. How'd you? You know, end up uh, um, um, bringing uh, Tamel into uh, into the family, and, and and now why are you crossing the lines hey, into into yeah we we'll get to the song <laughs> into R and B when when you're so synonymous with hip hop. Man, I, well you know I like to do it all, and um, I was introduced to Tamel uh, a friend of a friend, my man Twin. Mm. Shout out Twin. Shout out Twin. What up Twin? Who's very very uh, instrumental with. Uh, Migos and Young Greatness and okay. all, uh, Young Yachty, Lil Yachty, pardon me, all of those Same guys. Same shit, Young, Little, uh, Small. <laughs> yeah. All Yachty. those guys over there with Coach <laughs> K. Yeah, shout out to know, Coach K. Quality control. And, um, you know, we, we, we had conversation for a few weeks and then I finally met Tamel uh, in Atlanta, I think. Mm-hmm. In Atlanta. And then I went to the studio, the Quality Control studio, and they played me this music, man. And I was just blown away by the music. And what really got me before I heard the music, she told me the story, which she'll tell you her story herself. And it was just a really strong story of just perseverance and uh, inspiration. And you might even shed a tear when you hear it. But uh, above and beyond that, she's Did just you cry, Sorry. You, shed a shed, tear? Shed you, better not, you better not be crying. Come on, child. Hell no. Hell Tamel, we, dog, we, we didn't had a couple of little tears right. okay. shed, you know, during, during our conversations. But I just think she was, she was really talented, man. And you know, she she's not conglomerate or anything. She has her own situation. Mm-hmm. You know? Okay, look, Shaheen, God, Shaheen, but, I hope you ain't cheating. No, 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 no. It's all good. But these friends of the fam, you know, like we gotta, you know, as as a as an OG in the game and a cultural curator, as they say, mm-hmm. you know, I gotta help. To, to introduce the, the young talent, man, to keep well, it going. Well, this is what we should do. If we should play the song. Let's play the song. Cross the line. Cross the line and get to know her story. Yeah. All right. All right. That's I'm, up next. I'm a man. I ain't going to be crying up in here, but I'm, I'm ready we'll to hear your story. Okay. All, All right. right. 87760 Hip Hop. She said, okay. We're, we are crossing the line tonight. It's the Sergeant OQ review right here on Sirius XM. <laughs> Hip-Hop it's Hip Hop Nation. Sergeant OQ on your radio. Yeah. A few minutes ago, we crossed the line with uh, Tamel. Yeah, here's the thing. We, we want to get into in, into things first. You yeah. know what I'm saying? First and fast, because we're going to hold you to it, Tamel. Mm-hmm. The lovely Tamel, R&B singer extraordinaire out of Philadelphia. Tell us a little bit about your story, Tamel. A little Tamel. bit of bite to her. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us your story, darling. Well, I'm born and raised in Philly. Um, I started out. First of all, I grew up around a musical household. My dad is a music teacher. Mm. Okay. So I just, I've been singing before I could talk. You right. know what I'm saying? So Church choir and all that yeah, stuff. Right? All that, yeah. That is uh, crazy. Little, a little and, bit and all wrong that. singing for Jesus. We all started from church. Hey, if you yeah. didn't. Actually, he ain't started from church. I ain't even seen the inside of church. Oh, hell no. Hell no. I can't complain. That. My favorite song. 
<laughs> and nigga said, I can't complain. The name of the song is, I won't complain. Nah, that's the 2016 oh, remix. No. Shaheen, you still- I've, heard, I've heard I can't complain, though. <laughs> you went to the wrong church, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, keep going. Right. You the wrong anyway, song. yeah, so um, my, my parents, uh, I grew up in a strict household or whatever, so my parents separated when I was 10. Mm. And being as though my dad left or whatever, I was able to join a little local female R&B group mm-hmm. in Philly when I was like 10, 11. And make a long story short, when I was 12, I met Left Eye. Oh. Um, left Eye being from, that's another one from Philly. See, you be sleeping on, you know what I mean? She from Atlanta? She from Philly. I didn't know that. Yeah, all see, all these I, years. Yeah. Mm. So, I, yeah I, she, I was just about to ask you who were some of your influences. Well, now, now here's the kicker. Maybe I'm getting older. No, no, okay. keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah. So um, I'm, a lot of my influences are from Philly, and um, my main f- influence is uh, actually Barbara Streisand. She's a, mm, okay. you know, what? A extraordinaire entertainer. Right. Triple threat. That's what I consider myself to be. That's who I model mm. as an artist. Um, Barbara Streisand. A million yes. dollar Barbara concert. Streisand. Yeah, a Philly girl yeah. love Barbara Streisand. Yes. I'm sorry, yes. Lando. Are you? Are you? <laughs> I'm familiar you, with a couple of Barbara's tunes, yeah. but go ahead. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. But anyway, so Matt Left yeah. Eye. She loved the group. Um, she called us like the young female boys to men. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So make a long story short, um, we ended up going to Honduras with her to film a, a reality show. Right. And unfortunately, us shooting the reality show, fast forwarding, is when mm-hmm. the accident occurred. Um, and you were in the car. It was ex- I was actually in the car. Mm. Was ten of us in the car, flipped five times. Um, of course, we lost left eye. Uh, rest in peace. And... Um, Oh God! Every time I talk about this, I get emotion. Uh, lost her, um, and you know, unfortunately, I was the only one that was stuck in the car, mm. and I um, broke my leg, my tibia, my fibia, and my hip. So I wasn't able. So me being stuck in the car, I wasn't. Um, they rushed me to the hospital. I had to get uh, lost so much blood. Had to get two blood transfusions. How old were you then? Thirteen. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Mm. So I had to. Um, was uh, st- was um, stuck in a hospital in Honduras in a third world country by myself. Had to wait for my dad to come. It took him a couple of days to come because it was you know it was all over the new national news yes. about the accident. So it was crazy. Um, was there by myself. So I got you know had that abandoned mm-hmm. um, abandoned uh, issues or whatever. Um, so my dad came, saved the saved my life basically. Gave me some blood. Um, doctors told me I wasn't gonna be able to run again, dance again. Um, I'd be lucky to walk again without a limp. Mm-hmm. Able to, as you can see, yeah. able to do everything now. Um, it took some we time. watched you walk in. Yeah, you watched yeah. me. Yeah. You watched me, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> She's 13 years old, guys. No, I'm talking about now. I didn't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you? Nasty motherfucker. Fuck y'all. Hold on, let's get into it. So. <laughs> you see the gunman right there? <laughs> so. Kill the right nigga. Right? <laughs> That's not a real laugh over there. But <laughs> That's what's up. That nigga so. put his head down. That was no laugh. <laughs> So um, it took me about to be to re- to regain all my strength, able to walk again and everything. Well, unfortunately, I um, had five surgeries. They were trying to prevent because I wasn't fully developed. They were trying to prevent from putting hardware in my leg. Yeah. So I have a rod and screws in my leg. Um, Here's the thing, though. You know, you, you know, and, and I think everybody in the media has to apologize to you and everybody else in that car, right? God bless. The, the memory of left eye, the great left eye, the innovator. Yes. But you know what? Nobody, I, I see why you're suffering from abandonment issues. Nobody even talked about nobody, you. Nobody, yeah. nobody cared about it. It's like nobody else, else was no, in the car. That yeah. was fine. Yeah. That was fine. It's I not fine. I didn't, that didn't bother me. It might have bothered some other people that was in the car. I ain't going to mention that, but it didn't bother me. Mm. I want to talk about, damn. Fine. I want to talk about the aftermath of all of this. Hip Hop Nation. Hip Hop Nation Street Hip Hop Hits, period. Mm-hmm. We got the lovely Tamel with us. Yo, yo, yo. Well, we know she's fully recovered. Yeah. <laughs> Get off the table during the French Montana song. <laughs> but, uh, you know, but, but, uh, um, you, you know, um, she's a survivor. Mm-hmm. You know, she was in the car or, or the van when Left Eye uh, died, and, and she was a part of the emerging group. How many people were, were in that car? Ten. Ten, Ten people. people. And wow. she was the only one that died? Yeah. It was she was the only one that passed and, um, and she I was that, the only one that was severely injured. Yeah. Wow, okay. Um and you're a survivor. Mm-hmm. Yes. You, you know, and, and honestly speaking, for you not to, to have this voice until now, mm-hmm. you know, is, is is amazing. And you're fully recovered after all of your injuries, mm-hmm. you know, out uh, out from uh, being in, in, in Guatemala. Let me ask you a question. Seriously. Not Guatemala. 
What is it? Honduras. Honduras. It's kind of like, 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 like the same shit. Yes. <laughs> Guatemala, Honduras. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a little different, but go ahead. Yeah. Zika <laughs> land. <laughs> Sorry, Guatemala. No, it's not good. It's not I'm good. Joke, Guatemala. But listen, let's get back serious. Motherfuckers are mad at you now. Go yeah, ahead. right. Here's the, the thing. Hondurians gonna come and kill it. Here's the thing. Um, why didn't you just turn your back on music and say, you know what? In, like, 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 like. What kept you motivated what kept after you that? Motivated yeah. after that. Well, first of all, I'm from Philly. We don't give up. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, Rocky is one of my. I, that was man. Yeah. I, you couldn't tell me that that wasn't real. Mm-hmm. Like Rocky Sylvester Stallone, yeah. like that's for real for me. So I mean, I'm, I'm, you know, I, I never stopped. I went, especially once the doctors told me I wasn't gonna be able to do what I wanted to do. You right. know what I'm saying? They just said finish school, maybe go to college and just be a regular person because dancing and performing is not gonna be what you're gonna mm-hmm. do. And my mom was like, Nah, that ain't gonna be you. I don't see you doing nothing else but music so you had a supportive mother exactly on your team, yeah. exactly so i just kept on going you know what i'm saying and then once i was able to walk again and when i had full recovery like i said i still have hardware in my leg but yeah. i mean i forget half of the time I don't right. even bother because i'm a little dang you know what i mean I don't, I don't know if y'all well y'all will Easy. catch y'all will catch my shows soon so mm-hmm. yeah okay. y'all see how i get down y'all would never know you know so, what I'm saying? Do, do you write your own music yes i do write well i co-write i like to co- uh collaborate a lot you gotta, gotta specify because yeah okay hey, you know oh, yeah no. and i see five different names and <laughs> you know people looking at credits these days yeah, yeah. right now well, no, i mean i'm inspired by other writers i'm an r&b singer so okay. we collaborate you know i don't you know I don't you know what that you know what happened to the guy down the street that you know <laughs> Down the street in Philly. But here's the thing. Here's the, <laughs> That's wrong here's the you. thing. Here's the, here's the thing. Check this out. When you yeah. look at the, the the landscape of of um of R and B, you know, and shout out to the Queen R and B, Beyonce. Mm-hmm. And the in the in the princess, Rihanna. Mm-hmm. What differentiates what you do? You know, in in in, in cause you got a lot of hip hop in you, and hip hop is all about being different. Mm-hmm. How do you differentiate what you do as opposed to what's happening in the landscape of hip-hop right now? Well, honestly, I mean, I feel like everybody individually brings something to the table. You know what I'm saying? But with me, it's first of all my story, my perseverance, my determination, my empowerment. You know what I'm saying? But also, um, I bring that soft sexiness to it with the heart and the determination mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying so i feel like and i feel like who touched that a little bit was rest in peace to Aaliyah. you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. Aaliyah. but i'm totally different too at the same time so that's why i just i don't know i can't compare to compare it to nothing else but what i'm doing you know what i'm saying all right so when we come back we'll get a little taste of what's happening with you mm-hmm. and i want to ask shaheem what's the difference between the R&B singers and the hip-hop singers as it pertains to that dog being in them. Okay. Hip-hop nation. Sergeant on kill. Got the lovely Tamel hanging out with us. Yeah. Tamel hanging out with us. Shout out to uh, um, hip-hop. Um, how are we going to describe Shaheen? Uh, um, aficionado. Aficionado. I'm like, oh, all that. You know, you, you, you know, a, 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 a preserver of the culture. Mm-hmm. A, 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 a litmus gatekeeper. test. He's a gatekeeper and a litmus test. Shaheem Reed is here with us. Now, oh, Sha- well, right. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. This is nothing but the truth. Now, Sha, let me ask you a question. You know, because Tamel, you know, she, in describing her sound that's different than, than what's out there, I was just wondering, just from your perspective, you know, like, why... Why do this generation of, or why does this generation of hip hop artists, you know, particularly with them growing up on hip hop and having a hip hop sensibility, right. why don't they have that dog in them? Like, you know what? I'm better than this one, this one, and this one. As opposed to, you know, like rappers will tell you, who better than you? No, nobody better than me. I'm, I'm number the one. Best. I'm number one. Da, da, da. Oh, the, the, you, oh, you saying that the, the, the singers is. I think with the singers, it's, it's not as. Open mm. as as in hip hop, you know hip hop. We the most brash. We the most vocal. Most vocal. Yeah. I think singers. It's it's a lot behind the scenes. Like okay, I, I ain't getting on stage I with that ain't bitch. Going on after <laughs> <her>. <laughs> the diva moment. She gotta she gotta open up for me. Yeah, I ain't having. I ain't that. no fucking opener. <laughs> now, Sean, Sean, I wasn't around back then, but I heard. <laughs> He's lying. I heard that the goddamn if the Temptations was on. And the goddamn who else? Delphonics. The Delphonics or Blue Magic or whatever. They like, you know what? We better than them niggas. We about to shut this motherfucker down. What are we going for? Get ready for that Latin? new. 
New but, edition and four some Ds. Yes. I, I saw that on the on the special. Mm. New yeah. edition and four some Ds. They 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 had a little battle. A- according to the special, I gotta ask my man Michael Bibb if that's true. But yeah, you have to pick a side. Mm. All you boys to men are goddamn Jodeci, goddamn, and I was Jodeci. I I went with the crack. I mean, I I th- I, th- I think I think it was like that before. I'm like a you know, I I definitely think. You know, Usher and Chris Brown had their little competition, but it was more like a, a, a friendly side. Like, I've I definitely been in places with um, Omarion and Chris Brown, and these guys have had intense dance battles, you know. And like, they brought out the best but, of them. Yeah, yeah. But, but this was yes. all in the clubs, but it's, it's a little bit more friendly. And to Mount, I'm getting back to you. That's why I think that, that, that R&B is kind of flattened out because people don't want to – be the step on toes. Basically. Step on toes. Be the king of R&B. Shout out to Bobby Brown. You know, <laughs> yeah, <okay. laughs> they don't want to be that. You know, do you want to be that? Hell yeah, I am going to be that. That's what I'm trying. Now that's yeah. really. Now she is that. I am going to be that. But I mean, I just feel like you better than Beyonce. I, just, I, I, I feel like I'm no pun intended. I feel like a lot of people, some people put their foot in their mouth and I just feel like you just need to back it up and just Sean sometimes Proof, you ain't yeah. got to talk about shit. Cause you, you better than be Rihanna. What a clap set. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's get right to it, Sarge. So listen, I, we, we know you got to leave. Um, could you just, you, you know, can you just give them a taste? Bless us with Shaheem a taste. already told us if they want the full shit, they got to pick it up on iTunes. Pick it up on Spotify. All of Follow me stuff. on Spotify. It's Tamel, I-T-S-T-M-E-L-L-E. Right. Instagram, all of that. It's Tamel. All right, come on. Spot Tamel real quick. T apostrophe M-E-L-L-E. You got the apostrophe. Come yeah. on. But well, I mean, it'll pull up T M E L E. But anybody you know. not spell? I'm sorry, to know. I can't spell it like that. Come on. He's everybody slow. can't spell it, you know. Yeah, of course, one of us. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh. Every time you cross the line, you got me feeling like you got me feeling like, baby. When we were younger, back in the day, we had this game we used to play. It's funny how you make me feel the same way. Let me pick another flower, baby. Does he love me? Does he love me not? Or does he love me? Does he love me not? Does he love me? Oh, I'm just hoping that he don't get tired of me. I'm trying to tell you right now, we're coming. We are coming. Watch out, Rihanna, Beyonce. Who else? Let's all call our names. All of them. Tanache. We're killing them while they're young. <laughs> Tamal, it was a pleasure Thank talking you with you tonight. Anybody else, listen to me. Huh. You're rolling with a good team, good people. Stay grounded. And, and, and most of all, honestly speaking, you have a hell of a story, and we're happy that you're here to bless us. You know what I'm saying? Regardless of any, nothing can stop you because you've been through it all. Mm-hmm. You feel me, champ? It's proven. All Thank right. you very much. It's the Sarge and OQ Review right here on Sirius XM's Hip Hop Nation. You adjust that bring mic. That mic bring that uh, mic. Let me out. come a little closer. What up, what up, what up? Yeah. So, Tamel, you know, um, you're a. Uh, uh, um, you, you know, you're an uh, R&B sensation out of Philadelphia. Mm-hmm. Who's uh, come highly recommended come by highly different recommended. of Let me tell you something. Anytime Shaheem Reed, <laughs> legendary Shaheem Reed, <laughs> journalist, <laughs> extra, turn, turn, turn Shaheem Mike up. Man, you know. His mic is up. He's just cool like that. I'm all oh. the way up. There we go. All the way up. up. Shaheem, please. Don't start that shit. <laughs> because, no, you, you hear the music, man. Here's the thing. Listen. <laughs> Okay. The Bronx been kind of cold for the last tw- 20 years, and now Orlando uh, Fun. Well, you know, I like to do it all. And um, I was introduced to Tamel, uh, a friend of a friend, my man Twin. Mm. Shout out Twin. Shout out Twin. What up, Twin? Who's very, very uh, instrumental with uh, Migos and Young Greatness and okay. all, uh, Young Yachty, Lil Yachty, pardon me. All of those Same guys shit, with, young, little, with, uh, small. <laughs> yeah. All Yachty. those guys over there with Coach <laughs> K. 
Yeah, shout out to know, Coach K. Quality control and um, you know, we 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 had conversation for a few weeks and then I finally met Tamel uh in Atlanta I think mm-hmm. in Atlanta, and then I went to the studio, the quality control studio, and they played me this music man and I was just blown away by the music, and what really got me before I heard the music she told me the story which she'll tell you her story herself, and it was just a really strong story of just perseverance and. Uh, inspiration and you might even shed a tear when you hear it but uh, above and beyond that she's did just you cry Sorry. You, shed a shut, tear? Shut, you, better not, you better not be crying on, hell no, be, hell you know, no. me crying the dog we, man we didn't had a couple of little tears right. okay. shed, you know during, during our conversations but I just think she was, she was really talented man and you know she she's not conglomerate or anything she has her own situation mm-hmm. you okay know? look Shaheen God, Shaheen but, I hope you ain't cheating <laughs> <laughs> The Sarge and OQ Review, right here on Sirius XM's Hip Hop Nation. Yeah, man, it's the Sarge and OQ Review right here on Sirius XM's Hip Hop Nation. Straight hip hop hits, period. Sarge, all of a sudden, it smells good up in here. It smells good. <laughs> Hold on, check this out, Lando. It smells good in here. But here's the thing, though. I went to give somebody a hug, mm-hmm. and look what got on my phone, some mascara. Mm, to mascara. Let me get that shit off that phone. <laughs> Right now, bro. You yeah, mess up bro. my happy home, goddamn it. Ladies and gentlemen, straight out of Philly. Yes. We got the lovely Tamel hanging out with us. Tamel, tonight. what's up? What up, what up, what up? So I kind of got a reason to just scream Webster Houses projects and shit like that. So by the houses stand Butler up. Houses yeah. and cross. Yes. What, what's, what's that? What's that? What's that? Cross thing? Bronx Expressway. Get it right. Yeah, but go no, ahead. no, no. What's that? about street, that. Though? It's, it's not about that. It's about Tamel. Yeah, yeah, all that. Yeah. Hip hop was born there, but go ahead. Uh, what happened? <laughs> so, 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 you know. First, I'm gonna go Shaheem. Shaheem. Yeah. How'd you, you know, end up uh, um um bringing uh, Tamel into uh, into the family, and, and and now why are you crossing the lines hey, into into yeah we we'll get to the song <laughs> into R and B when when you're so synonymous with hip hop. 